Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to be talking about and kind of explaining how you could possibly move your project from Adobe After Effects to DaVinci Resolve. So let's get right into it. Now, these two project types or the project extension for After Effects and for DaVinci Resolve are simply not compatible. So if you have your entire timeline uh, with all the edits made in uh, Adobe After Effects, there is no way that you can export that to DaVinci Resolve. I'm pretty sure the encoding methods are different, so you cannot really uh, change uh, or edit those encoding methods to actually fit DaVinci Resolve. So there's no way to export it with all the edits, just like you would, for example, a Premiere Pro uh, edit. Now, uh, what you can do is you can render and export your video from Adobe After Effects and add that as a video to the media pool. Uh, you can edit it and export it as a image sequence. And then what you can do is just go to media and DaVinci Resolve, just to make sure that you are able to import the image sequence go to the three dots under media storage, click frame display mode and select sequence. And then once you go into the media pool under the edit page, and if you add a sequence of images here, let me just import media like this and select a sequence of images like so. As you can see, it'll be uploaded as one single file, which is an image sequence, which is kind of like your video. You can do that or you can do a completely different uh, method. And that method is to export or render out your video as an Apple ProRes uh, 4444 with alpha, you can just select the QuickTime uh, well, method and then select the preset for the Apple uh, ProRes 444 alpha. And then you can export that and then import it into DaVinci Resolve as you would any other video. And then you can edit it however you have only the uh, whole video as it is already rendered and done. You cannot, as I've mentioned, access the edits in DaVinci Resolve and that is sadly the limitation which you will reach with this hope you guys enjoyed and i'll be seeing you guys in another video